Hi, welcome to another video. So today is 7th of September 2015. Microelectronica are now catering for the PIC32 MZ microcontroller. So I've had one of these development boards, PIC32 MZ, for a while. This came from ElectroPIC SNADPIC in Prague. Similar to the PIC32MX795 board I demonstrated a few months ago. So fantastic. These will knock the competition out of the water. So I've wired this PIC32 MZ 200 MHz microcontroller up to my Microelectronica Microprog programmer that already does all the current ECUs. Update the firmware on this and it now does the PIC32 MZ. Fantastic. That's my PIC32 dongle, in case you haven't seen one. Update to the software and that's it, I'm away. I'm obviously going to wait for Microelectronica to bring out the MCU cards. So these are the regular Microelectronica MCU cards. I've got two DSPICs here and another PIC32 MX795. So I couldn't see any of these on the website this evening. Maybe these are going to be released very soon. So I can't wait to get my hands on a proper one. As I say, two DSPICs and a pick, another PIC32. Plus the one on my development board. So if there was ever a time to buy Microelectronica's compilers, it's now. So that's the address top of the page, microe.com. The, the compiler is still $299, which is half the price of some other PIC32 compilers I've seen. So get onto their page, have a look. $299, Micro C Pro for PIC32, or now including the PIC32 MZ, 200 megahertz microcontroller, fantastic. And you'll see just down here, new chip supported, the update adds supports for 24 devices from the super fast PIC32 MZ family of 32-bit MCUs with MIPS M14 core. Can't wait to get started. So this is Microelectronica's standard EasyPIC Fusion version 7. That's the MCU card. This is just the PIC32 MX795, which is still a good microcontroller, it runs at 80 MHz. So I couldn't find the MCU cards on Microelectronica, but as I say, there's never a better time to buy Microelectronica's hardware and software. Thank you for watching.